Good morning, everybody. Welcome back. So we are going to do a Dutch pour this morning. Um, it is going to be um, black. This really pretty, I, I made this color as kind of a coppery gold color. Um, I combined a couple of metallics. We've got a blue and then we have a white. This white is, I guess, what they call the cell activator for the bloom, the Shelly Art Bloom technique. Um, but I'm just going to throw it into the Dutch pour and see what happens. Uh, we've got four ounces of the Artist Loft Flow Acrylic Black mixed with about 1.5 ounces of the Deco Art Americana Pewter and about 1.5 ounces of water until you get this nice, uh, it's a little bit thicker than we would normally do for a Dutch pour, but because we're using the activator, um, I wanted it a little bit thick so it doesn't, the activator doesn't sink. Our pretty coppery gold color is uh, 0.5 ounces of the Deco Art Americana 24 karat gold and then 0.5 ounces of the Americana copper and then about 0.25 ounces of water. And then I also added in this Liquitex slow dry blending medium and um, it's kind of a binder. It's going to help bind the colors together, uh, the pigments together, so hopefully we don't get any splitting. Our turquoise is the Artist Loft Metallic Cobalt Blue, about 0.3 ounces of the paint and about 0.15 uh, ounces of water. And then we've got our cell activator. It's a little bit different than most people do. I kind of just threw it together and made it up. We're going to see if it works. But it was the Deco Art uh, Pouring Medium. Put that lid back on better. So it was the Deco Art Pouring Medium, um, 0.5 ounces, um, 0.2 ounces of the Amsterdam Acrylic Titanium White, um, just one squeeze of the Liquitex Acrylic Ink Titanium White, and then to thin it up just a little bit because the Pouring Medium by Deco Art's a little bit thicker, uh, about 0.1 ounces of water. And then I also threw in some glitter for good measure, just this extra fine glitter. We are going to see what happens. So it's kind of a concoction that I just made up. I just grabbed stuff and we're going to see if it works. Um, that's it. We're going to do a regular Dutch pour. We are probably going to go through the center, um, just a, a center pour to, to go out. And I think that is it. It's a pretty basic dutch pour nothing special um we are using the con air cord keeper 1875 link is down in the description um highest air pressure lowest heat setting and then i also use the cool button and that's it so we are going to go ahead and get started
All right, we are all done. Uh, we are going to leave it just like that. Yeah, I'm kind of on the fence about it. Don't know if I like it or not. Um, I'll have to figure out what to put on it for Comic Con. I got to think of who I can put on there for this one, but. But I think our, our cell activator or whatever was too thin because we just, we really just lost it. But, but that's okay. It's a trial and error type thing. So we will see how it dries. So thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section. Down in the description, all of the paint colors used as well as the mixture ratios. Um, also down in the description, links to my Instagram, Facebook, Pinterest, Twitter, as well as my website, guidedbyfaithdesigns.net, is where you can find all of my vinyls and my paintings, guidedbyfaithdesigns.com, is where you're going to find my mugs and my tumblers and all of that. So, like I said, getting ready for Comic Con, I have a whole bunch of new stuff coming. So, this is one of the Harley tumblers, the Puddin' Tumbler. Um, we've got that one. We've got some Hulk tumblers that are hydro dipped. So we've got those. Um, this is actually a Loki beer stein. So this is a large beer stein, 60 or um, 30 something ounce beer stein, I think, that we have for Loki. And then, of course, got coffee mugs. And also my new style of stuff, which is my wrapped mugs. So I've got these as well, um, all handmade and uh, very unique. So go check those out. Uh, again, guidedbyfaithdesigns.com is where you're going to find all of that stuff. Guidedbyfaithdesigns.net is where you will find my vinyls and my um, paintings. So don't forget to like, subscribe, share, stay tuned um, in a couple weeks for part two of this whenever I decide what we're going to put on it for Comic-Con. And then also hopefully coming up close to the end of this week, we are going to be finishing up the Wonder Woman painting as well as Harley Quinn and Nightwing. I just have to go get vinyl for those. So again, thank you very much for watching. Like, subscribe, share, and as always, God bless.